Oh, I love this one. Russ is with the shit. He's with it, okay? He warned these guys. If they responded on Breakfast Club, he said one of those guys got washed for being disrespectful. He was talking about young bands or smoke perp, right? Well, one of them responded, and he warned them that the footage would get leaked. And it got leaked. <laughs> now, I, yo... Smoke Perp, I'm not the biggest fan of Smoke Perp, okay? He got in with sympathy. He was one of the first SoundCloud rappers. Uh, he went broke uh, about a year ago, complained he was sleeping in a car, and then, you know, people gave him a chance. Now, I like Little Pump. He's cool. He stays in his lane. Smoke Perp talks a lot of shit, all right? And this is why this happened. He disrespected Russ's family. Now, I'm not with the random shits, okay? But when someone... You know, some people just push, 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 push the limits. It's not like this guy. This guy's a rapper, okay? And rappers push the limits sometimes. Bloggers different. Rappers different. When you're a rapper and you're, you know, it's totally different. Let's get in with this because Smoke Perp had to explain his way out of this one. It's Jordan Taylor with JT News. Uh, hit that bell, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment. I read all the comments, okay? I read them all. And if you want to run ads on the channel, it's JordanTownMedia at gmail.com. Okay, so we got young bands responded, and he said, F Russ, that never happened, blah, blah, blah. So, of course, Russ had to leak the footage because he promised he would on the Breakfast Club. So there's footage. I'll, li I'll link the footage below because I'm not going to put – shout out to Academics. He's the one who put it out there. Um, but I, you know, I'll link it below. I'm not going to play the footage because uh, they don't like that shit on here. But uh, – you guys can watch it on Instagram. He gets washed, okay? A bunch of... This is how rappers move. The entourage... If you ain't moving with an entourage and you're out here talking crazy, you're gonna get washed. And he got washed. So then Smoke... So, so Smoke Perp... Uh, Russ had talked about Xanax and all this other stuff in 2017. Preaching that kids should stop abusing drugs and everything and you know mental issues it's not good you're pushing this on the kids it's absolutely true because look at all the people we're losing little peep uh, uh mac miller and whether you like these people's music or not there's more of them uh chief keef's uh cousin i, I forget his name. and then so many people die because of drugs right now okay it's an epidemic, man. You know, the, the, it's, it's cool to use drugs now all of a sudden when it wasn't cool, like, just a sh short amount of years ago, okay? It wasn't even cool seven years ago, really. Um, so Smoke Perp told him to shut up. Then eventually Smoke Perp, like, put up Russ's sister as his Avi. Like, super disrespectful, okay? So Russ washed him. He <laughs> saw so him at a festival and washed him, Okay. And Russ below it put, don't worry about me. All my homies want to fight you, Russ. Uh, bullies get bullied. That, that, that's absolutely true. So then Smoke Perp puts this out. Like I said before, I go in the bathroom. I come out the bathroom. It's like seven dudes there. I ain't never seen them in my life. You feel me? They, they look like they with the fuck shit. I'm with the fuck shit. So I didn't give a fuck. I fought all seven niggas. I fought all of them. All of them. Russ did not do shit. Russ is scary, my nigga. Russ is scary. Mm -hmm. He's scary. He did not want to. He do not want to fight me heads up. He do not want to one on one me. So I guess he sent them dudes to jump me. And for me, I was with the fuck shit. I don't care, niggas. I came out the bathroom. They was there. I fought all of them niggas. All of them niggas. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this guy is so. Sc this guy was scary right here. I don't really like this guy too much, as you can tell. <laughs> now, what do you say right here? We all know if me and Russ went heads up, I'll beat the brakes out of Russ. I'll beat the shit out of Russ. And y'all can set it up real talk. Me and Russ go heads up, I'll beat the shit out of Russ. So let's get to it. Let's get to the story. So this happened like three months ago at, what was it, Splash Festival? Splash Festival in Germany. So, uh, we we in the green rooms. It's like a it's like a little staircase. You go upstairs to the green rooms. It's like two green rooms and a bathroom. I go. I use the bathroom. I come. We know what happened. Okay, 
Now he signed to uh, he signed to uh, uh, Travis Scott, and back in the day, you're you know ten years ago or so, your your career would be washed at this point after getting washed like this. But uh, unfortunately, it'll probably propel his career forward. Yeah, you know, I like some of his songs. I just don't like certain things rub me wrong with this guy. Okay. I like Little Pump. I like a lot of the new kids, okay? I, I, they're having fun out here. I like 6 9 I like all these guys. Russ is one of my favorite new acts, man. You know, uh, you know, and I thought he was really arrogant in the beginning until I listened to him a little more, and I was like, nah, he makes a lot of sense. You know, it, it, I can relate. Like, he does everything himself. Like, in the beginning, when I was pushing the envelope on videos... I did my own lighting, everything. And I didn't get the respect. I'd edit, video, everything. This is when cameras were big and dookie. Right before DSLRs came out, cameras used to be big, dumb cameras. Spending, like, fucking 10 grand on a camera. Then, when DSLRs came out in 2007, 8, when I first got the 5D, that changed the game. I got a steady cam, and that, and that was nice. You know, 5 grand, you had a full setup. It was easy to like that shit. But, uh, yeah, Russ does all his own stuff, so he wasn't getting respect. And, you know, there's a lot of funny games that go on in this industry that, you know, if, you, you know, either you speak up on it or you just let it happen. He speaks up on it, you know? So, anyways, then 6 9 welcomed him to Treyway. Then Russ added this comment. He said, people think this is high school on some meet me after class, like one on one. Nah, you talking crazy ish online, and I've never met none of y'all weirdos or talked to y'all. Lie in the bed you made. This is not after school parking lot fights. Take your ass beating and move on. Hey, Russ, <laughs> speaking fags, man. Um, perp fans are pissed. I mean, you know. It is what it is, man. Uh, these guys will move on from this, and I'm sure Perp will think twice about putting someone's sister up and, and disrespecting I mean, Keep it between you two. That's it, man. Uh, anyways, this is George Taylor with JT News. Leave a comment below. Let me know. I'll, I'll read it, man, even if it's negative. And uh, hit that like button. That's important. Subscribe. And if you want to run ads to the channel, it's jordantowermedia at gmail.com. I'll check you guys later. Peace.